you that was so gross as you can tell by the title today i am filming a back to school clothing haul slash what i got in tennessee haul <laughs> i actually got ready for this video can you believe it that never fucking happens by the way this shirt's from gymshark as you can tell but i'm just gonna jump right into this video because i feel like it's gonna be a long one as you can see by all the stuff behind me i did quite a bit of damage so i'm gonna tell you where i got everything i'm just gonna start with this red bag right here <laughs> so i tried to organize it by shop but i don't think that it's gonna be that organized so i apologize First thing I got was like, like scrapbook papers. I journal in case you didn't know. If you want journal videos, just let me know. It's that easy. But fall's coming up. Fall is my favorite season if you didn't know. So I got a bunch of like fall themed papers. I got a bunch of shirts that have like animals on them that are tie dye because I don't know. I just love the way those look so much. So I got literally a million of them. This first one has a wolf on it with headphones and cool piercings. It's really cool. Then I got this wolf one, which has a bunch of different wolves. I got this lion one. This is probably my favorite one. It has like very Rastafarian vibes with the dreads, headphones, little Jamaican beads in the dreads. I love that one. That one's definitely probably my favorite. Actually, no, it's my second favorite. Then I got this dinosaur one. I love that one. I got another wolf one. They're like howling at the moon, obviously. Now this is my favorite one right here. It's a bear and it has like galaxy. And it's purple. Then I got some Life is Good shirts because they're really good quality and they're cute. This one obviously just has a bear with sunshine and a rabbit and it's peach colored. This one is teal obviously. Has that cute little design. And then I got this like red one. The cute daisy on it. And then I got a peach one with a bumblebee on it. Those are just really soft and comfy to like wear around this next stuff here is a bunch of random things and i got a tie to go stick because this shit really is important if you go to school because stains happen then i got these beauty cleansing wipes because i needed them i feel like i'm having an allergic relax relaxion reaction to this lip gloss right now my mouth feels weird that's probably not good then i got some deodorant because i ran out on the trip it's the secret convert if you care oh this one's really cute okay so i got this little <laughs> black bear snow globe because every time i go on a vacation i always get a snow globe to remember it and when i do a room tour you'll see all my snow globes okay then i got this keychain that has my name on it, Audrey in rose gold, because a bitch got a car, my first car, and I'm gonna put it on my um, car keys. I also got a gift for my friend Morgan. I got her the same one, except it obviously says her name, so that's really cute. This first thing here is just like a little quote inside this really cute um, heart. tie-dye glass thing it's just like a little um thing that you put in your room as like a positive reminder and it says be bold be strong and it's green blue yellow kind of pink and i go through hard times and i know that this is gonna help me one of those like car charms that you um hang from your car mirror it's just a crown and then it has little dangly things as you can see and I'm gonna put that in my new car. I did get some stuff for my car actually on this trip. Now we're gonna move on to this beautiful bag. First of all, I got this reusable bag from 
Publix, which if you don't know what Publix is, it's like a Walmart, Meyer grocery store chain that's in like the southern states. They had one in Florida and in Tennessee, but they don't have one where I live, so that's kind of weird. First thing <laughs> I got is this watermelon meditation floor pillow. I've been wanting a floor pillow for meditation for like the longest time. And this one's super cute and it was really inexpensive too so that's cool so my family we're really into like martial arts and self-defense and stuff like that so we like we like our weaponry i should say not anything obviously horrible but we like little pocket knives and things like that so this is just like a little pocket knife and this is the kind that you just you just do that and like it pops in and out like really quickly in case you need to defend yourself or whatever and it has a cool little spike in the end if you can't open it fast enough so that's pretty freaking cool and it comes with a little carrying case Tennessee has so many knife shops I'm pretty sure it has the biggest knife shop in the world actually so that's pretty dang cool we actually went to that big knife shop and we got a few weapons this is a medieval dagger as you can tell this is what it looks like in the packaging it's very very beautiful to be honest if you know what these words mean please tell me because i don't know but it's just like a really pretty thing. It's just a really pretty little dagger. I love it. <laughs> it's National Geographic. Beautiful, world's most beautiful places because I love traveling. I have actually like a huge National Geographic um, Greatest Landscapes book that I bought from Barnes and Nobles, but I wanted to get this too because I want to go to as many places as possible that I think are beautiful. This next thing, oh my god. These are Naruto throwing knives or kunai. It's like a little set. It's so cute. It's gorgeous. It just comes with like a little pack and then your little throwing knives it's so cute i love it if you watch naruto or anime you know what these hoes are they're great got some juicy fruit gum for school because juicy fruit's my favorite gum and i haven't had it in so long and i saw it when i was down there and i was just like forget it then I got this professional oral care kit because you know how at the dentist they have those like little scrapers and stuff? Well, I have like a bottom retainer on my lower teeth. Like it's like a little bar behind my teeth right here. And I can never get floss like down there and the plaque builds up. And then my freaking dentist always yells at me even though I can't help it. So I just got the little plaque things that they have so that I can do it myself so that they can quit bitching at me. Oh, I know what it was. I really hope it's not broken. Oh, no. So we went to Cracker Barrel and they had like Halloween stuff out and if you know like Hispanic culture, I think especially just Mexican, I'm not sure about other branches of Hispanic, but I know in definitely Mexico, they celebrate the Day of the Dead. So this is like one of the little sugar schools. And it broke. And I'm so sad about it. I mean, at least the whole thing isn't broke. At least it's just like a side. Because I want to use it for my little nightstand over here. That's so sad though. But it's okay. It's not that bad. It's not horrible. It's fine. Now, for this big one. We went to the outlet malls down in Tennessee. <laughs> I went a little overboard, just a little. So the first place was the van store, right? I didn't buy vans, even though I am going to buy some. So I got two lunch boxes because they were having a sale. 
and I'm trying to be healthy and not eat school lunch this year because you know I'm trying to go on my plant-based shit you know so the first one is this cute cotton candy colored one it's gorgeous it's my first pick I love it oh my god it's gorgeous then I got a galaxy one because they were having the sale so I got two and I think they're both super cute then I went to Zoomies my all-time favorite store ever in the entire world ever ever and I got a few things first thing I got was some odd future socks because I didn't have these ones and I wanted to get an odd future shirt but they like up the price to $34 and I said fuck that but they were having a 3 for 12 sock sale so I did pick up some more socks first I got these like red blue and white striped ones these are super fucking cute my god then these yellow and purple Neff ones and if you didn't fucking know yellow and purple are like my two favorite colors as you can tell they're so cute oh my gosh and then i got these pink yellow and navy blue and gray ones because i love stripes and i love socks then i got this gray champion headband and i really wish that they had a black one but for those days where I'm gonna wear a messy bun to school. I thought this was perfectly adequate because God knows I can't afford that supreme shit. Then I got this odd future air freshener. It's the Santa Cruz collab. And I can't wait to put that in my car. It's so beautiful. I'm gonna keep it even when the scent runs out because it's just too cute. And then last but not least from Zoomies. Ooh, that highlight your girl got this army green thrasher shirt i feel like this is not the right size it says size small but it looks so big and i know it's the guys but usually the guys fit me well so this is kind of weird but well but i just got this because i have my wheat air force ones and it looks so good with army green oh my gosh that is gonna be the sexiest look ever <laughs> So, um, your girl's titties grew. <laughs> so I needed to go bra shopping, right? So, um, I did some damage in the Hanes store. Lots of bras. Then I went to Route 21, which this was actually the first store I went to. And I got a lot of stuff because they were having a bomb ass t-shirt sale. And I have way too many t-shirts. But it's fine. This first one is so fucking me. You can ask anybody. Everyone knows like my favorite colors, or at least my favorite color combo, is primary colors, right? Red, yellow, blue. So it's just like this red, yellow, and blue paint splatter shirt. <sighs> I'm so excited. I got one kind of similar to that, but it's just like red and yellow, which is also a really good color combo. And it's just like McDonald's, but like a black and white paint splatter. Like, I don't know. I just think that's so cool. Like graphic tees are like what I wear all the time. Like they're my favorite style of shirt. Then I got this tie-dye rug rat shirt because when I was a youngin, my brother and I used to watch Rugrats together. And it's just very reminiscent and nostalgic for me. Why is it folding fucking weird? Then I got this super cute yellow, you know, my favorite color, tie-dye Minnie and Mickey tank top for the gym. And I'm so excited to wear that. It's so cute. The next thing I also got from the store that I got the bras at. And honestly, I wish we would have been back to get way more, but we had already spent like three hours trying to find the perfect bra. It was tragic, <laughs> but I got this black champion crew neck. 
and it's so comfy and warm i got in a size medium because i like it to be oversized and comfy for the winter time and it's super cute and fleeced and nice even though i wish i would have got like a million other ones but it's fine school starts i want to get these um black like feather slides that i can wear with like dresses and stuff because i think they're really cute i think they make my toenails look really cute and i also want red vans before school starts yes forever 21 i am a bath bomb lover and i get bath bombs like my life depends on it so i just got this little three set one and I can't wait to use them. That's <laughs> all there is to that. Then I went to Claire's and I got these cute ass hoop earrings. They're in the shape of a heart. They're so cute and they have like little rhinestones. They're gorgeous. I love them. It's this little like boutique thing. And by the way, all those like t-shirts with like the animals on them, I got those from like t-shirt shops in Tennessee. I You really cannot find those like anywhere else but in the South, I noticed. Or like, like I found like my first original ones in like my Goodwill, because you know, I'm a thrifting ass bitch. But they don't have them all the time, obviously, because it's a Goodwill. But when I went down there, I knew that they would have all of them and they did, so I'm so happy. But yes, we went to this like bag place and I was going to get like a black leather structured purse because I don't know. I just really want a good quality purse, but I just haven't found the right one yet. But we did find this little toiletry bag because my toiletry bag, like it's good, but it isn't this good. You know me? <laughs> we went to Old Navy. I don't know why I said that so good. But I got the Big League Chew Bubblegum because this is me and my brother's favorite bubblegum ever. And it's just like the best flavor, best consistency. I just, we love it, we do. Then I got these cute ass little pants. You know how all the thoughts be wearing these with the cute little stripe? <laughs> no, but they fit really good and they're really, really cute. Don't know, no, I love reading. I know that sounds weird and fucking nerdy, but I like expanding my knowledge. Sorry, but this book is the first one. It was the secret wisdom of the earth. And it's just about like some boy who goes to Kentucky or something and his life is fucked up. So that looks good. I got this big magic self-help book because I've been struggling with my mental health recently and I find like motivating things like this very helpful for me. Then I got this Stephen King book called The Body and I've never seen this before in my entire life and I've always tried to get into Stephen King but his books are just too dense for my capacity. So this one is a really thin one. So I'm gonna, uh, whoa, 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 whoa. so I'm really looking forward to this one because I've never read Stephen King and I really want to. So I'm gonna save this for October. My favorite month of the year, by the way. It's actually weird because my birthday is in April. My half birthday is in October. And October is like my favorite month of the entire year because I love scary stuff. I love haunted houses, scary movies, all that stuff, Halloween, everything. And I think it's weird that like my half birthday falls in October. Then I got these, moving on. <laughs> I got these cute stickers. They're just like teddy bears. That one's like teddy bears. Yeah, that one's teddy bears. And then this one's like random cute little baby animals. Cause again, I journal and I like having cute stickers. This next thing is kind of crazy and it may seem weird, but I have like mini travel journals, journals. It's like when I travel, I take like a little book like this and that's what I write my experiences in. So I have one right now and it still has plenty of room left, but I know I'm gonna need more and like these were like perfect and inexpensive. So I got like an orangey red one a brown one, 
a yellow one and a gray one. So, and they're only four bucks each, which is so good for these like pleather things. Like, I'm excited. Next thing I want to show you is just some like back to school clothing that I got from like thrifting and stuff. So it's this flannel, right? <laughs> I love this thing so much. It's so me. It's like a bunch of different patterns. It's crazy. It's wild. It's everything I want in a flannel and more. And I just loved this thing. Like what? Also, from a thrift store, I got this Tommy Hilfiger jean skirt. It's so gorgeous. I got it from a thrift store, bro. If you didn't know, I work at Goodwill. So, I'd be finding all the good stuff. <laughs> but yes, this is like so perfect for school because it's like the perfect length. It's just like when it's hot out and you don't want to wear jeans, but you want to like follow the dress code. Like this is what this is. <laughs> okay. So the last things I got from Walmart. If you didn't know this, and you're on a budget, Walmart has really good like workout clothes. Me, I know personally when I go to school, I'm gonna be on a tight schedule, working out like all the time. And these last pretty long, but basically, I just needed some workout shorts that were like longer because I don't really like my ass hanging out at when I'm working out. So Walmart has these really good like spandexy kind of longer biker shorts and they're really cute actually. So I got like three of those in like slightly different patterns and stuff. But yes. And then they also have these really nice like cottony material ones. So I just got one of those because I needed longer ones that were nice like that. Last thing in this haul, honey, are these two little things from Walmart. So I just got these like pack of two like beauty sponges, blenders, whatever you wanna call them, because they're really cheap and you can never have too many, especially when you're going back to school and you about to beat your face every day. And then I got this audio aux cord cable for my car because obvious reasons, like music is so important to me. I need my phone, I need my Apple Music in my car, blaring before school if I wanna have a good day. So I got this for my car. Now, you thought this was the end of the video, but no. I'm about to show you my car, Daisy Ann. Her name is Daisy Ann Honeybee. I know, that's weird. <laughs> But I'm about to show you guys my car and that's going to be the end of this video. And then I will be filming like a back to school supplies haul before school starts, obviously. Because I did buy some supplies from Walmart, but I still have to go to like Target and stuff to get a few other things. But I'm going to end this video off with showing you guys my car. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and if you did... Like, comment, subscribe, follow my social medias down below. And are y'all ready to see Daisy in my car? I bet you are. So it just got finished raining. So if it's windy, I'm sorry. But here she is. She is a teal cobalt coupe Chevy. And she is my angel. She's beautiful. I love her. She's like a perfect little first car. She's gorgeous. I really hope you can see that license plate. But yes. So this is the aftermath mess of the video. Um. Yeah, it's kind of a mess. So... What I'm gonna do is clean all of that up and just in this video right here. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. As I said before, my links, well not my links, but all my social medias are down below. 
and I hope to see you next time. Bye, bitches.